Welcome, here is Kathy from Kathy Director, and this is a new Photoshop tutorial. This tutorial is all about the new YouTube layout 2013. It may be coming out end of February 2013. I have an example how the layout will look like and you can design your, pa uh, your Facebook channel. Here I have the YouTube page from iJustine. She's one of some partners that already have to test out the new YouTube layout. I just want to show you today how you can create our YouTube banner. I'm not sure if it's just for no I'm not sure if the banner is just for YouTube partners or, or normal YouTube channels too. So on this banner you just see the um, normal banner here and on the left top corner you see a picture of her this is a new channel profile um, picture so when you upload a picture it's over there in the left top corner so keep in mind if you want to make when you make a banner don't put stuff in the left top corner so people will, will not see it here is a second example from epic mealtime they have the new layer too. You see the profile. You see the profile picture, the banner, and here some links. These links are generated by YouTube. This is not included in the banner. So if you make some links on the bottom, keep in mind that if you go and add links to your YouTube channel, like Twitter, Facebook, uh, website, don't do it under the banner over here. You can already do this on the YouTube crea creator blog here. The link is in the description too. And we should go prepare for the new channel design. Let's go in Photoshop and I will just show you how you can create your YouTube new YouTube banner. First of all, I have a template. I made a template that you can download if you want. So and now I will go and explain you what you will see on your channel. So here you have in the middle of the area, this area will be visible on all devices. That means it will show you the normal banner here on our channel like I just did too. This is the middle of pink area. It says the minimum of or desktop and, the mini m and on mobile you see just this banner too. If you are on a tablet it will add this space too and on the right, left and right. So it makes the banner larger. When you are on our large desktop screen and you have these dimensions 2120 by 350 you also will go and see these left spaces here and these left spaces. So the whole banner will be like that. Keep this in mind. But if you watch YouTube on our TV, you will just have the whole screen area here. So if you design something cool, just keep in mind to go create a background and the middle for the banner. I made already examples, so I will just show you my design. This is my new design. Don't look at these um, guidelines here. Uh, this is just for have the correct spaces. I will show this in a second. So this will be maybe my new design. These links on the bottom here, like Minecraft and After Effects stuff, you will not see you can't click it on the new youtube layout this sucks so let's go and i will go and show you how you can create a cool banner so first of all make the background for that we need to go and make our new um background so it's these um dimensions here so i just will go and go and fill this with black also, we'll go and make a gradient with some cool blue, maybe. Some kind of this background. 
So I will get just make a pattern. So go and double click and you can have any pattern you want. There are some basics pattern here. But I have the pattern metal mesh patterns pack. I don't know it's by exertion. I don't know where from where I got it, but I have these cool mesh design here. Then I have some pictures that you can search on Google if you want. So here we have here we have a kind of um, glowing thing, grungy glow streaks. And keep in mind that you have your banner in this area yeah, in the middle. Just go and choose a blending mode screen. And you have that. When you have some areas like that, go just raise it with the razor tool, whatever you want. Then we have... Well, then you can go and create your text if you want. So Alright, so for tutorial we have now this kind of font and some gradient style here so don't ver don't care about that if you have that we can go create some kind of background so maybe something like do that and drag it under your stuff now you can maybe go and drag your glow on the layer over here and go and give it all cool maybe something like that and then you can go and add as many as you want here so i have some lens flare set it to screen again and position it cool something like that i want to have it in the background so go and drag it under your um, rounded rectangle shape like that position it a bit better something like that well maybe on the top so and go and erase some stuff with the eraser tool here some corners something like that and the same for another lens flare here so when you have that you see you have now your kind of banner here so keep in mind somewhere over here will be your profile picture and here somewhere will be your links so keep this in mind but if you have that so clear locks and you will see it's a nice cool background that you will see on the whole um, TV screen and yeah I hope you enjoy this tutorial and please give it a thumbs up and comment under this video if you want. If you have any tutorial requests, let it me know on this video and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.